How's it going people? Today we're at Petersfield Skate Park in Hampshire. My name's Rob, we're here to scope it out. Let's go take a look. All right, so let's get into this. This is a skate park made by Wheelscape. It opened in 2010. It's a, it's a long street skate park with a, with a bowl just on the other side. They're both divided really nicely so there isn't any clashes in between the two. It seems like a really great skate park setup. It's really nice. So transport, this parking, it's fairly easy to get to. There's a car park right next to the park around the corner. There's Petersfield train station, which is about a 20 minute walk away. So it's a little bit of a distance. Um, it seems like there's a lot of places in the town to, to be able to, to stop off and grab some snacks and some drinks and maybe go to the loo. So the ramps, we've got a quarter pipe on both ends. There's probably about two lanes for a back and forth. And um, there's a flat bank with a square rail. It's got some steps on it and it's got a little bit of a Euro gap and a ledge to grind down on the, on the one side. It splits off into two and then it's got, on the left hand side, it's got a shorter runoff. A little bit like a fun box. It's like a, a couple of ledges basically with another water pipe. Then there's another rail and then there's like a curvy bank um, that you can kind of pump and do jumps off on the end. Then you've got two more ledges and then you've got this quarter pipe on the far end to turn around and come back again. The bowl is huge, giant deep end of the bowl, and then that cuts up to probably about a five foot mini ramp with a few different types of ledges and a few different kind of transitions. And it's got a, like a rollover in the middle to gain and lose speed. It's a nice park. I like it how everyone can have a little part of the park on their own. Um, a little bit to, to just choose and do a few tricks and just hang about. And, and stay in that area without getting in the way of anyone else. I really like that kind of design. The square rail on the flat bank, that seems really cool. It goes from like maybe about my knee height, so just over a foot, and it then drops down to about a foot and a half, so you're getting a little bit of distance on that. There's a tiny little Euro gap. It's really narrow. It feels like threading a needle sometimes when you're trying to ollie down it or go up it, um, especially when there's this ledge right next to it. I like this side section where you go up a flat bank and then you've got a couple of ledges on each side and then a quarter pipe. But actually that jumps off back into the rest of the park so you can go up the ramp and you can use that drop off to do a trick and then get back into the, the rest of the skate park. Square rails are always really, really great for learning how to do grinds and slides. You get a little bit more stability. It's a really great step up and a really great way to learn how to do that. It's just the rails are a bit big. They're a bit tall. It takes quite a bit of a jump to get into them. I don't know the name of it, but it's, I'm going to call it like a pump kicker, where you, you go up and then you pump down and then immediately after you've got this little kicker. It's, it looks really fun. It looks really cool. It's almost like the start of a, an interactive skate park. And that's it. Petersfield Skate Park in Hampshire. It's a well-rounded park. There's plenty to do, plenty of different ranges for people. It's really fun. You should come and check it out. It's, it's, it's cool.